Hi you guys and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I have a new palette by Colourpop to review for you guys. This is all of that. Do you want to see what the swatches are, how I created this, and what my first impressions are? Stay tuned. because these are like my go-to colors and yes I have tons of palettes in the same color scheme but I love ColourPop and I just wanted to try this one out so again this is called all that this is the box that it comes in and on the back it does go over the colors here's the actual packaging there are some spots on there that are more like a shiny as you can see on the hearts <laughs> there is the back of it and then the colors are the shinier material. So when you open it up, there's not a mirror, which is no problem because I don't use it anyways. There is this little guy that I remove. So there's the top lid, very cute. And there is the entire palette. And again, now I have used it once. And how I created this look right here, I started with this uncuffed and I went over my entire lid then I put this risque <laughs> under my lower brow bone. Then I went through with come through and kind of went over the top part. Then I deepened that color up with wink, wink. <laughs> I even winked in the video too. <laughs> when I read the color, I was like, oh, wink, wink. <laughs> so I used wink, wink to darken that up. Then I went in with please me in the corner to darken it up even more. And then I went in with fishnets over my lower lid, but it kind of, in here, this kind of looks like it would be like a goldish color, but when I put it on, it turned almost the same color as I had above it. I'm like, um, okay. So I went back in with Risqué <laughs> to make it a little bit lighter. And then I just went underneath with a little bit of Please Me and a little bit of Wink Wink <laughs> on the lower lash. And that is how I created this look. So again, here are all the colors and I will go ahead and swatch them all for you. Hold on. Okay, you guys, so here is the entire palette swatched. A lot of the first few colors are very light, so there's a light pigment to them because they are lighter shades as far as going in through here. Then you go into like the darker burgundy tones and then that's like that black color at the very end because I went in order. So again, there is that. Now, for the colors that I use, I really did enjoy the colors. I loved how they blended and the pigment and how it showed up because you could see the layered in colors. Now, yes, uh, I am really loving the way that they all blended and the way that they look and how the pigment stays and is nice and bright and pigmented. <laughs> But again, um, this, these lighter colors are what I use to kind of set my base and start to build with the color intensity with going in with the darker colors. So that is my first impressions are, I'm loving this palette. And again, I know I have other palettes that are similar. I probably even have another ColourPop palette that is very similar to these colors, but these are my go-to colors. I love using more of the burgundies, not necessarily the pinks, but they kind of have to coincide together. <laughs> so I just really love the color scheme. So when I saw they came out with this, I'm like, oh, all right, you're pulling at my strings, all right. And I wasn't going to get it. And then <laughs> on good old Instagram, they do like those little stories where like things like do things. Well, they had a ColourPop one and it said, what palette are you? And a ding, 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 ding. And it came up with, bing, this Mars palette. And I was like, ooh, those are my favorite color. And well, a couple of you guys actually said, it's meant to be, you should get it. So I did that filter thing again, like a few days later, and I got this same exact one. I'm like, oh my gosh, all right, maybe you guys are right. Maybe it is meant to be. So I went ahead and I purchased this one as well. And while I was on there, I had to get California Love because if you guys know, I am a California girl currently living in a Florida world. So 
I just needed the California Love, plus this is more brown. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you both of these. I'm not gonna swatch them right now, but if you wanna see future looks with either of these or both of these, comment down below and let me know. I'll make it happen, Captain. I will go ahead and do them for you at a future date. Just let me know. If not, I'll just stick them in my arsenal and use them when I feel like it. That is so pretty inside. All the green looks like water. So this is the Mar. I said Mars earlier, I think. This is Mar palette. So here is the actual packaging. It does have the colors on the back. Hey, hey. it's a little crooked, but not too crooked. Normally all my stickers are crooked that I get. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me or what. Ooh, okay, so um, here are the colors for this palette. <laughs> very, I love, uh, very blues and the browns. I'm actually liking the color scheme. Oop, you're falling out there, dude. There you go. Um, I'm not too fond of like this gold color, but all the other colors with the browns and then the blues and then like that teal, those are really, really pretty. So this is one of the palettes that I got. There's that. And then the California Love, if you want to see what this one looks like. And again, if you want to see a look with either of these, let me know. But here's the actual packaging. Palm trees are so California like that. <laughs> so the inside is like this. And then, ooh, that is so pretty. Look at those colors. That is so pretty. Browns are my definitely my favorite in my comfort zone. I am stepping out and doing more of the burgundies and you guys are saying purples look good on me but browns are my all time favorite. So once I saw what this was going to look like on the inside, I'm like, I have to get that. Plus it's California love. <laughs> I had to anyways. <laughs> so here is the California love palette one more time. So those are the three different palettes that I just purchased from ColourPop. But you guys know, I love to give back to you guys. So this purchase, I did actually purchase a few for you guys. So, if you're still with me and you are interested, this one again is the one that I just use on my face. Here are ones that I bought for you guys. So I bought two extra, all that palette. So two lucky winners will win one of each of these. And if you did see my meant to be ColourPop, I purchased this Get Money, the Velvet Lux Velvet Lip Liquid Lipstick that they have out now. And that is this one I hear, this one is mine. And I really liked the color. I did actually try to put it on with this look, but this is more of a brown where this is more of a burgundy. So I didn't feel that it matched, so I took it off. But I do like this color and I do wear this quite often with other color schemes. So I got two more of the get money for you guys to go with these two palettes. You can wear it with the palette, you can wear it without the palette, you can wear it however you want. But these are the two that will go with this. So if you are interested in this palette and this liquid lip in just a second, I will let you know how you can enter, but I will show you what this looks like on my hand. I'll swatch it for you guys. So at least you know the color. It is really nice and dark. Um, you can kind of do like a lighter color or you can make it more of like an intense if you want to add a little bit more to it to make it a little bit darker. But I really do like this color and I think it would pretty much go with a lot of skin tones and what you're wearing and that kind of thing. So get money is added to these two palettes as well. So again, these are mine. Now, if you would like to enter into winning one of these two little sets here, then number one rule is you must be subscribed to my channel. That's why I do my giveaways to show my appreciation and give back to those who are actively and here positively supporting me on my channel. So if you are here positively supporting me on my channel, then definitely subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a big thumbs up and leave one comment down below. And in that comment, use the word all that in a sentence. Just put in all that however you would like, but all that make it cap so it stands out that I know you are actually saying or doing by the rules and not just putting something about all that <laughs> in your comment. So one comment with the words capitalize all that to enter. You can leave as many comments as you would like, but only one per user account entering into this giveaway. So when this ends in three weeks, I will have a random comment picker. Choose a comment that has all that in caps and I'll filter through and I'll have two lucky winners win. I will respond to both of those comments saying, congratulations, you are the winner. You have 48 hours to contact me back. If you do not contact me back in that was 48 hours, I will have the random comment picker choose a new winner or two new winners, depending on who responds and who doesn't. 
um, and so on and so forth. The new winner will have the same rules, 48 hours until I get a confirmed win down in the description box, which will have the official end date and all of the official rules. I will say once it ends, congratulations to so-and-so has 48 hours to confirm. Once they have confirmed, I will put confirmed. So if you see still has 48 hours to confirm on either one of those two entries, cause there's two winners, two sets, then hang tight because I may have to draw a new winner and the new winner might be you. Other than that, you must be over the age of 18 or have a legal parent or guardian, somebody over the age of 18 enter in for you. And you must have a United States address for me to ship these to. I don't care where you live, as long as I'm paying for a US shipping address to mail these to to help me cut down on shipping fees currently since I do pay for all this myself. <laughs> so that is all simple, easy, like I do all of my giveaways, be subscribed, support my channel positively, give this video a thumbs up, leave one comment down below entering one only for your entry and have the words all that in caps in whatever unique way you feel like using it. <laughs> and in three weeks, we will see who wins. Congratulations to the lucky two winners and good luck to everybody who is interested in these two palettes. Thank you guys for being here and watching my video. Let me know what you thought of this, how I created my look, what the swatches are. Let me know what you thought of this palette. Let me know what you think of these two. If you wanna see looks or not, no problem. I don't mind either way. <laughs> So again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Your positivity means the world to me and I greatly do appreciate every single one of you. So until next time, you know that drill. Keep a smile on that gorgeous face of yours and I will see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye, Crafty Crew, out.